Marshall. <laughs> uh, I'm going to tell people I went back to the Northwestern to be this year's Gary Marshall. Uh, it's great to be back here. Get it up for the best marching band in the country. The Beatles should do a tribute about you guys. <laughs> The other way around. Um, it's great to be here. Uh, this is my uh, 15th year uh, reunion. Uh, I graduated in 1996. Uh, that was a very depressing time to be in college. Uh, grunge was very big. So we decided that was a cool way to dress. It wasn't. I apologize to all the women from the class of 96. We all looked lousy for like four years. Uh, there was no Facebook. It was very hard if you met a girl and wanted to see other pictures about her. You have to like, go to the library and look up microfiche. It was arduous and depressing. So we were depressed, and then a great thing happened, which was the 1995 Northwestern Wildcat football team. And you know, I don't remember who they played or who they beat. Oh wait, of course I do. They beat Notre Dame, they lost Miami, Ohio, they beat Air Force, and then in order, they beat Indiana, Michigan, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Illinois, Penn State, Iowa, and Purdue. Uh, and then they went to the Rose Bowl, and I T-voted it. I haven't watched it yet. No spoilers. Uh, but it was really exciting, and it was so great to go to a school as good as Northwestern and have a football team that good. And it's been so exciting under the Fitzgerald era to have this team be this good. Woo! this competitive and it's been really excellent and uh, I want to thank you guys very much for coming back and I really hope we beat Penn State tomorrow. Yeah. An interesting fact with Joe Paterno versus Pat Fitzgerald, the largest gap in age ever between two football coaches, 155 years. <laughs> Can I do that again with a rim shot? Is there a drummer? <laughs> Largest age between two coaches ever, 155 years. Wow, you guys can't hear me. That's alright. A little late rim shot. Um, it is now my honor, I've got to introduce you on your homecoming court. And most grand marshals would just come out and read this list, but not me. Uh, I have lived with each of these people for the last week. Yes, you have! I consider them all my best friend. You're my best friend too, Sam. You guys, please welcome your home coming part. Woo! And your dear friend, Northwestern Interfraternity Council, member of Sigma Alpha Epsilon, tour guide and a Bible study leader in Greek University, Katie Bradford. Yeah, give it up for Katie Bradford. Associate in student government, student life vice president, and member of Chi Omega Sorority. Our next two, Tyrus Jones is a running back for the Wildcats. Woo! Four members only, and Vice President for Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated, Emily Fletcher. Give it up for Emily. Vice President, Risk Management for the Panhellenic Association, President of the Golden Key Honor Society, and the Vice President of Gamma Sigma Alpha Great Honor Society. I'm realizing how little I did at Northwestern. <laughs> I was in Deering Library before this, and it struck me that I'd never been in Deering Library. <laughs> also, with as much as we pay for tuition here, you would think there'd be a podium for me to set this paper up.